Hi, this is Marco, and today I want to show you how to calibrate the Corgi EM9280 wheel balancer. Uh, first of all, you would need a regular size wheel, so nothing too big or too crazy. 15 to 18 inch is usually the preferred choice. Uh, first step will be to pick up the dimension of this wheel, just like that. Make sure the width is correct, then we can exit to the main screen. From here, we will go into menu configuration programs then display other icons these are the hidden icons and the first one on the bottom is calibration when you select that it will ask for an additional confirmation and at this point you can lower the hood or if you have a machine without the hood you can just press the start button the machine will do the first spin and basically measure the residual imbalance on this wheel but you don't need to put anything additional on the wheel or the shaft during this first spin. As you can see, when it stops on the second step, it tells me to put exactly 12 o'clock or when this target is in place, the calibration slug mounted this way. So with the weight toward the inside of the wheel. And as you can see at 12 o'clock, you have a threaded hole now where you can mount your calibration slug. Make sure it's tied all the way in and then proceed with the second spin. Again, either start or if you have a hood, you can just lower the hood. This is spin number two. On the third one, the machine will actually ask me to rotate the calibration feature 180 degrees. So we are actually going to remove it. You see the machine automatically brought it at 12 o'clock. At this point, we can rotate it and put the heavy part of the weight on the outside of the wheel. All the way tied in and lower the hood or press the start button. And now do not touch the hood or anything on the machine. If the machine is mounted on a mobile van, try to keep it pretty still because it will do few sample spin automatically at different speed. If the calibration is successful, the machine will actually display OK on the monitor and it will beep three times when it's done. And your calibration is done.